Hey y'all, Andrew here at Bank of California Stadium, the new home of LAFC, which is Los Angeles Football Club, um, which is our, the newest MLS team, uh, Major League Soccer, to come in 2018. This team will begin um, their official season starting in January, and new players will report, and a club will form, and uh, it will rival the Galaxy across town, but it will also just be Los Angeles' newest uh, professional sports team in the recent years. We've had two NFL teams move here and now a new soccer team, pro soccer team is moving here, LASC, in January 2018. So why am I filming from this parking lot and letting you guys into this knowledge about this new team is looking, is, is for the fact that I'm looking to actually serve this team in some capacity with my role with Athletes in Action. I've begun to build relationships with front office staff and management and um, coaches and, and as, as, the, as all of that takes shape, I've begun to build relationships with them. And what's great about being at UCLA is it's bridged a lot of those gaps. It's bridged a lot of those relational gaps um, because the soccer community here in Los Angeles is really connected. So that's a prayer request as uh, we turn the corner of 2017 into 2018 just to see what God would do with a, with a new professional sports team and me just be willing to serve, whether that's a chaplaincy or whether that's just a life coach or a mentor for some of the uh, the, the club and um, I'm just looking to see what God will do with that so I'm trusting him for these things and and um, just putting it in his hands so update on ministry we just got back from Shanghai China uh, with our UCLA men's basketball team it was an exciting time with some rough times too uh, certainly on the international scale but at the same time I was really encouraged um, we were able to do chapel with those guys and really build into that uh, that team and that program and really see God overall, been able to see him overall, just really encourage our UCLA athletes over the past few months as this school year has started now and um, we're getting into rhythms and motion. And, um, but there's also things that are volatile, um, coaches being fired and staffs changing. Uh, but at the same time, God's sovereign over all this. And at the same time, Despite uh, maybe a rigorous academic schedule, we're seeing athletes take steps up in their walk with God, in their journey with Him, and they're growing. They're putting on that permanent spiritual muscle to really fight the battle, to fight that good fight that God has called them to fight here in this city. And uh, so I appreciate your prayers. I appreciate your support of the ministry because you're sowing into something that's eternal. This stadium behind me is very material. It's being built. But in five years, something's gonna break on the stadium. Some, a toilet's gonna to break or a ceiling light needs to be repaired. And those are temporal things. But when you invest in the kingdom, when you invest in what God's doing, those things have eternal value. Those things don't need repair because they're always being renewed. And God's doing a new thing in the city of Los Angeles. He's doing a new thing in the lives of athletes all over the world. And I believe he can do a new thing in your heart and your life as well. So. As 2017 wraps up, that's my prayer, that you guys would have a renewed sense of what God's doing in your life and around the world. And uh, would you pray for this club, LAFC? Would you pray for the UCLA Bruins, all sports teams? And would you just pray for a great end of the year, to finish well, not to just loaf off into the holiday season, but to see his kingdom come in LA as it is in heaven, and your city as it is in heaven. So thank you guys so much. Have a great Thanksgiving 2017. See ya.